Hello all. Uh, viewer asked if uh, there's a program that you could install in uh, Arch Linux uh, to alert you of uh, updates uh, not only through uh, traditional Pac-Man but through the Arch Linux user repository. Um, so I'm going to just go through that briefly. It's fairly straightforward. Uh, there are a couple of uh, things you have to do as of now that might change in the future. And I should mention that I did include in this uh, include this in one of my uh, respins uh, a few months ago. So it's called PAMAC, uh, P-A-M-A-C, and uh, you have to get it through the Arch Linux user repository. So down at the bottom left, right, left, right, <laughs> it says six updates available, and there's two. Uh, programs actually there's package manager and update manager so the update manager um, depending on your network connection I'm I found is if your networks uh, readily available on uh, reboot there will be a notification if you have notify or some kind of notification daemon running so if you right click and go to update manager it refreshes the uh, pack the uh, mirror list and you can see there's six updates and then you press apply, for example, and then uh, leaves the GNOME uh, keyring, I think, comes with XFCE4. And apologies, I should have mentioned this uh, is XS XFCE4 desktop. 412. Okay, so now it's downloading and it will install the packages. You can click on details and you can see what it's doing and your system's up to date you can click refresh to refresh the mirrors and it's updated and the icon down here uh, turns to on um, red non red <laughs> so I'll close and actually I shouldn't have closed that let's go back to package manager not this one sorry update manager and refreshes again this is what the user asked if it's enable AUR support and yes it does work um, a couple of, I've been trying this for a couple of days and uh, there was a package in the user repository and it was updated and you have other options here so how often you check for updates and so on so you press OK official repositories uh, and sort by speed okay now the other one that I uh, opened was uh, the package manager uh, this window should be down a little bit and again you can start search through the AUR Arch Linux user repository for something like uh, I use locale purge locale P U R G E press enter to search and there it is there you see that it's installed okay and you can clear the search and search for something else um, you can refresh the database and obviously there's no updates okay so it's it's a neat program it's from Manjaro or Manharo or Manharo I don't know there's different ways to say it I guess Manjaro is easy to say so we'll close this and I'll open a virtual box and uh, log into uh, basic XFCE configuration to uh, show you how to go about installing this as of the now of this date because as I said things might change Okay, so let's go through a, a run through. Um, so you want Yao Art installed on your system, okay? And you want uh, Pam, Pamac. And there's two here. You want the second one, Pamac 8-AUR, and just press two. And we'll see what happens. Uh, just uh, no dead at the package, no dead at the install, and continue building. And your password, if you have that set, and proceed with the installation. You just saw there it said downloading Vala 2.8 and this is what happens you get an error to get around this is uh, back to Yaoart and get a program called downgrade oops okay close enough it's the second one here downgrade right here so you just press 2 enter and just let it you know you can edit the package or not continue building and give it some time to download and Okay, so let's try out uh, downgrade. It's very simple. Vala. The package it's looking for in the uh, 
PAMAC is version uh, .26. So I'll press 2. And this is just for uh, compiling, basically. You can remove it later if you want and uh, proceed with the install. I'm going to select no to, for the ignore group because I'll probably uninstall it. So let's try it again. Caution, though, no, you might have to do a reboot. So, Yawart, uh, Pamac, and again, two. We'll see what happens. Edit, edit, no, continue building. And we'll see what happens. Okay, so after some time of compiling, uh, just uh, select yes to continue. There we go. Pamac is now installed. And just to, I would suggest uh, reboot, uh, restart the system. Okay, so after restarting, uh, there's the icon up there in the top corner here. The, uh, it says your system's up to date, so you can go to Update Manager again in VirtualBox. Uh, look at this. See, I didn't add the Vala to the Ignore group, so it's gonna, it wants to update. So I'm just going to close that because we don't need it. And uh, remove the Vala. So, uh, and quits. Let's see. Let's re there. Actually, that was pretty quick, so it automatically refreshed. Okay, and I forgot to install notify, uh, notify D notifications on this uh, virtual box. That's why it didn't pop up. But if you install that, um, it should come up with a message saying updates are available. Okay, so I hope that helps the user out and anybody else wants to have sort of a indicator that includes the Arch Linux user repository, both updates and installing. Um, PAMAC is, is a, a great way to go about installing. And it's under the, it'll be under uh, System, Add, Remove Software uh, for getting packages and then a software updater, which will pull every four hours by default uh, for updates. Okay? So that should do it for this one, and thanks so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon, and bye for now.